I must admit, I didn't think much of this robot the first time I laid eyes on it. It looked so stiff and lifeless, sat there on its docking station. I didn't think it was going to move at all. I can see why some people might be scared of him. He had a walk and a talk that just wasn't normal around here. That's why I'm here, to deliver this safety speech to you, right now. Where the hell are my friend Dave? Say hi to Dave, everybody. Dave is now going to create a safe barrier for you, the audience, and an area for Titan to perform here. Today, there's a 97% chance of rain, so we could get wet. Phones, hearing aids, I said hearing aids. In fact, anything that's not waterproof must be placed in a pocket or in a handbag. Yes, that means you too, sir. Please be aware that sometimes Titan's lights flicker on and off, giving a strobe effect. Personally, I think this is just faulty wiring. There is one thing we do ask, and that is for you, the audience, to please stand up and remain standing for reasons that will become apparent during the show. It's at this point that I find myself so excited I can barely sit still or hold the thought in my head. I've done my bit now, and it's time to hand you over to someone who, I hope, can put a bit of enthusiasm into this introduction, which I am so rightly deserves. Engaging larger than my voice of the character from the telly. Right then! Let's get this show on the road. He's as curvaceous as Kim Kardashian. Even more ginormous than Dwayne The Rock Johnson. 47th in line to become the new King of England. And bookmaker's favorite to be Britain's next Prime Minister. Quite literally, the biggest entertainer on the planet! Ladies and 